John here. I picked up some of the cheapest snowmobile covers I could find on Amazon. And I'm gonna put these things on, see how they look. Oh, by the way, I bought these things with my own money. I just needed something to cover up some snowmobiles. And I thought it would make a quick little video. So, not sponsored, not free items, just honest, whatever. I'm showing you what I got. I just moved the old John Deere snowmobile into its summer resting place. All right, got the Amazon package opened up. These come in like a little stuff sack. If you're a camper or something like that, you'll know what I'm talking about. But basically it's attached to the cover and everything stuffs back in. Got a little carrying handle on it. It's pretty sweet. Nice little package to throw on the shelf. Um, I'm gonna pull it out of the stuff sack and get it on the sled and we'll see what it looks like. I'm gonna get this thing fitted on the best I can and I'll get back to you guys in a minute. Okay, I got the cover on. I got it hooked the best I can. This is supposed to be a trailerable cover. And I kind of figured that would just give me a little bit more protection outside. Um, but it's pretty, fabric feels pretty good. It's got this Velcro flap here. If you forget something, you gotta get in there. It's, I don't know, you left your key in there or whatever. Um, fits on this old John Deere pretty good. There's obviously some points that I couldn't get a hook under just because it's not designed for something like this. But I think um, for the 38 bucks or whatever I spent on it, it's money well spent. Except for I had a snafu. I pulled a little too hard on this to tension it. And that buckle just broke. So, I mean, you can probably replace these buckles with something else. I just tied a knot. This thing's not going on a trailer or anything. It's just going to sit out in the yard. I just wanted to keep the elements out. Well, this is what this cover looks like on this John Deere 400, 1972. If you've got an older vintage sled, you're into the old stuff, this might be a good... Uh, Something to keep it out of your garage for the summer. Time will tell, really. See how good this thing holds up, but I'm gonna put it right there and uh, see how she fares. So I can't guarantee anything here, but if you wanna try your luck with this, based on what you see in this video, there's a link down below. So check that out too. All right, I got my Puma 340 out here. I'm gonna see how this one fits and oddly enough this one came in a zippered bag so it's a little different but it's kind of the same we'll see maybe i'll be able to tell apart under here <laughs> I'm not even sure what this is, but it's definitely not the same thing as the other thing. I don't even know what this is meant to cover, but it ain't a snowmobile. So, uh, real world experience. That's what I ordered. I got one of them and that's what I got. I'm not even really sure what that is. Not what I ordered. So I'm gonna have to sort this out and call it a day. And I guess the Puma's gonna sit outside uncovered. So, oh well, we'll get it figured out. Anyways, thanks for watching guys.